Okay, this is going to be a video of how to get Android running on your phone. This is the website that pretty much all the Android builds originate from. It's XDA Developers. And this is the HD2 Android Development uh, Board, you could say. And all, most of these threads have different builds. This guy, Darkstone, has is the one that made the the uh, build that I, I'm using on my phone, and he just released a new version, version two. The one I have right now is version one, so let's check that out. It's a new version two. He shows you a picture of what it looks like. Pretty much the same thing as what I have now, but he has more working features so this is change life for version 2 theme change more transparency now creates one gigabyte uh, data all that stuff G sensor stuff okay keep scrolling down keep scrolling down now if you want to download this is this the link you click Bring this to this page. It says Royal Stone Series version 2. And this is today's date. That's when he just released it. Uh, it just tells you the parts that make up the build. Change log again. What works. Wi Fi works. GPS, 3G, camera with flash, Bluetooth headset fully supported. LED status and uh, notification, keypad, LED control, camcorder, USB tethering, and what's not working is Wi Fi tethering and compass. So, it keeps scrolling down, it tells you what is radio, it uses radio 210. But I use radio 212, and it's where you download. It says this is version 2. So you click there. It brings you to the screen download screen. You have many options you can use. Rapid share. Use rapid share, multi upload, mega upload, deposit files, all these. So you choose whichever one you want. I already clicked rapid share. Here it is. So I'm gonna click download. I use a uh, win rar win r a r that's why originally I saved the file there first. So I'll come back when it's finished downloading. Okay, I'm back and the download uh, just finished. So we're going to go ahead and open. Like I said, I use when I use WinWire. Go to Documents. Downloads actually. Go under Downloads. You look for the file. That's the file. Click Extract Files. Okay, first of all, go to your home page. I mean like your home screen here, you create a folder, I have this folder here called Android, empty folder then you go under the downloads and you find the file you just downloaded which is that one, for your stone sense version 2 right click, extract files and you look for the folder that you just created which is, I titled it Android so you click there you press OK. And then it will extract the files to that folder. At this point, you should connect your phone to the USB and then connect it to your computer. So it pops up under. So it pops up under computer. And there you see the phone. So just minimize that. While this finishes uh, extracting, so 
so it's done come back to the folder here Android folder you click it and these are the files you're gonna see this is a readme it pretty much just gives you the instruction on what to do how to install it to your phone or and all the changes that it is uh, that he made so you can close that this is the folder Android it's titled Android and this has all the files you need to run this uh, on your phone so what we're actually going to do is we're going to copy that folder into your phone but first of all I have to delete the current Android thing that I have on my phone so I'm going to scroll down Delete this one. Okay. Then we'll copy and we'll copy this one over. Just copy that over to your phone. And five seconds to go. Okay, so it's done. So we're done with the computer for now. I'm gonna go over to the phone. I'm gonna take out the USB cable. Go under the file explorer, and there's the uh, file under the storage card. See the folder titled Android, you click it. You run CLRCAD first, and then you click correct. So yeah, this is the first time that I'm booting this up on this phone, this new version, so it might take a little while. There's a green LED light that's coming up right there. So usually, yeah, the first boot will take three to five minutes. That's why it's taking so long when you're running, you know, a new build for the first time on your phone.